Hey there, Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. Where are we, honey? We are at the Hilton Grand Vacations Flamingo. Okay, in Las Vegas. Thanks for watching these videos. If you've not hit the subscribe button below, please do so. Also, that bell notification button below because that will get you notified when we put up future videos. And also the like button. We're going to check out the room here at the Flamingo. I guess it's fully remodeled is what you said, Yeah, right? it is. It's been fully remodeled. I just finished this up, so we'll have to check it out. So we've got a one-bedroom in the studio, so let's go and take a look at it. So come on in, hon. We're going to start on the studio side because we've got the one bedroom in the studio. And we start, as we come in, you actually have a little bit of a foyer when you come in. You've got a main door that's uh, that's keyed. And then you've got the two doors to the one bedroom and the studio that are also keyed. So we're going to do the studio first. We've got both the studio and the one bedroom. So let's look at the studio first. First thing is when you come in, you walk right into the kitchenette. And this is nice. This is a cool fridge that actually you can use for nightlight, honey. Yeah, you can. It's not a freezer. It's just a fridge. Actually, a pretty cool fridge, too. You got a microwave. It's a oh, is there a light on underneath there? Yeah. Oh, there is a light. And you've got a pretty cool, pretty large microwave up here. You've got a uh, mini sink. You've got a tea kettle, a coffee maker, ice bucket. And then you've got some condiments there. Why don't it's under here first? There's your fire extinguisher and your uh, dish soap, along with the scrub daddy, or a scotch brake, rather. And they have these tile behind here. Not bad tile. Mm -hmm. Then you've got uh, glassware, silverware, and uh, your toaster's up there if you want it. Let's see what's up here. Oh, oh the plates there. You've got plates and a couple of cups and a couple of uh, glasses. So plastic glasses, by the way. So they're not soft clothes, trust me. I've they're found, not. I found that out the hard way already. So we'll go in the bedroom. You want to do that first? Yes. Slide on in there. Start with a full-length mirror. Say, oh. hi to, say hi to everybody. Hey, okay. Everybody don't usually see me, but today you get to see me. Yeah, say hi to everybody. Hi. Hi. Yes, I know I need a haircut. No, uh, you don't need a haircut. Uh, yeah, I'm good. Um, so you've got the bedroom in here, and this is fully remodeled. This is nice. Wow. King-size bed. And I know that you like having uh, end tables on both sides of the bed. Yes, I do. Look at that. And you have this uh, end chair. It's like a bench seating. Um, and you've got an, uh, and more seating underneath there. So a place to put your computer and work on is down at the other end. I do have to complain. complain. The TV is not big enough. No, it's not. Not for this room. Right. Normally, it's me that complains about TV. You're complaining about the TV right. this time. I could tell you the... TV's not big enough for me. Well, let, so. take a look at the size of the thing. It, it should have a much larger TV on there. You're, you're absolutely right. You do have a DVD player. Um, drawers underneath. Let me open the drawers. I guarantee there's nothing in them. I just want to see if they're soft clothes or not. So let's see if they're soft clothes or not. They are not soft not. clothes. Uh, you have a desk, as I pointed out before. USB and plugs. Right on the top of the desk, so you don't have to find a find a plug. Oh, we have a pool view. Do you notice that? Yeah, we have a pool view. So uh, we share the pool with the Flamingo Hotel. Well, that's so, when we heard, yeah. Yeah, and it looks like the pool is available and open. Look at that. You can use the pool. It's a little cold right now. It's like 30 degrees today. And you have these uh, seating tables. This, this table. coffee tables. Coffee tables. Way. And then this should be a sofa bed. Should be. Should be a pull out. Is it a sofa bed? Yeah. Is. Yeah, it, so this it, is, a sofa, is a sofa bed. This is a pullout. So that's a so sofa bed. This is basically a twin pullout. Mm -hmm. And then again, you got the king size bed uh, with uh, end tables on both sides. I do like this. This I've always liked these. The adjustable reading lamps um, next to the bed. And I want to talk about getting these at home. By the way, I've said that for a couple of years. Mm -hmm. And then they still have the tub. That um, that they did not get rid of the tub. That's One not thing, fun. Come here, honey. I want to show you something. Come here. I wish they would get rid of this. I don't like this. Why? I don't like this. I wish this would be solid or at least closable. Oh, why so, not? Don't you want to talk to someone when you're in bed? I would rather have a little privacy if I'm in the tub. Oh. So you come in here to the bathroom. Well, before we get there, let's do the closet. It's right here. There's your bedding for the sofa bed. You do have an electric safe, hangers, ironing board, iron. You like having a luggage rack. There it is. Mm -hmm. and there's also a trash can in here. Hardwood floors, by the way, are uh, faux hardwood floors, I should say. 
Single, um, single sinks, not double sinks. But light and mirror. Mm -hmm. A lot of people are going to the light and mirrors. I like that a lot. And what's in the drawers? Nothing, probably. We'll check. Oh, right no, out. there is. Hair dryer, toilet paper on this side. And nothing on this side. And right. you have the shower area. Oh, I like the size of the bathroom toilet area. Mm -hmm. Let me see the shower. And let's go in the shower. This is always Steve's little thing about the shower. I want to make sure it's tall. I don't think it's tall. It's a little skinny. It's a little tight, and it's just barely tall enough. Right. But it's very functional. It really is. But again, not quite tall enough for me. Okay, so we are in the studio side. So let's slide on over to the one bedroom side and see what that looks like. So now let's do the one bedroom and see what the one bedroom looks like. We've already seen the uh, studio side of this. So let's look at the one bedroom as we walk on in. Two closets, honey. There are? Yeah. This, yeah, this is a closet here. I'll bet you this is a washer and dryer. There should be a washer and dryer in here. Let's see. <gasps> yep, it there is. You There's your washer and dryer, apartment size washer and dryer. And you do have one thing of laundry soap. Oh, but there is also an ironing board in there and an iron. That's oh, that's hidden. Really, that's really hidden. It's back there. That's hidden. Okay. So we'll do the kitchen last. So you want to do this way and go to the bed? No, we'll go to the living room. Okay, go to the living room. So over here on the right, you've got a bench seating and a small table. Computer table. I don't know if I'd call this a computer table or not, but I guess you could sit here and use it as a computer table. Um, I don't think it's wide enough to be a real computer table, but it is good for bench seating. Or a laptop table. Yeah. So you could use that. And then you've got bench seating at the table or the um, uh, island itself. So a... they got rid of the table. That's what they did. Mm -hmm. So they made this longer. We have a previous video of what it looked like before. So I'll link it here of what it was. But that's what they did. They got rid of the table and made it longer. So you've got uh, seating for four at the island and then seating for another two over here. That's how you can seat six. Mm. And in here, they get in, into the living room itself, um, you've got the television, you've got a coffee table, you've also got a chair, and I don't think that pulls out. Yeah, it does. Does this pull out to do something? Because it's supposed to sleep four in here. No, this is a, this is a pull out. I don't think no, the chair that does is. not. So this should be a pull out right, right. here. That, that is a sofa bed. Yeah, and it's a pull out. Mm -hmm. So this is a pull-out, and this is a, this is a full-size pull-out, so you can sleep two here. Right. Um, you have an end table with a phone. I don't see USB chargers here. Um, but they're, it's they're, there on the wall. There is a couple of USB chargers on the wall over there, so um, they, nice, nice artwork. Yeah, the color scheme is totally different. It's changed. The flooring has changed. Everything has changed. Come into the kitchen, you have the microwave. This is, is different. This is different. Oh, it's a pull down. Oh, this is different. Yeah. I've not seen one of these kind of microwaves before. You can put a pizza on there. Yeah, that's something different. I've never seen one of those. You've got your dishes up here plates, uh, cups, dishes, bowls, uh, a couple of plastic cups as well. You have wine glasses over here, honey. You'll be happy. And then uh, under here should be pots and pans, no, mixing bowls, and a baking dish. Uh, along with a uh, cake uh, cake dish. Moving this way, some utensils, including a pizza cutter. Ice cream scoop, too. Uh, there's your toaster and a colander. Mm -hmm. Up here, you've got steak knives and other knives, along with a pair of scissors and your tea kettle. By the way, these, these are so cool because it just, you just, Put them on here, fill it with water, put them on there, push that down, and it'll boil. And it'll pop when it's done. So it's an electric range. Flat top stove. Mm -hmm. uh, condiments here and a regular coffee maker. You know, that's missing. That's well, what the difference is. There's no oven. You're right. Unless this is the oven. Unless. This has got to be the convention oven. So this is a dual oven. That's what's missing. Before there was an oven here. Now there isn't. You're right. Absolutely right. There's your pots and pans under the, under the stove. Uh, and there is a nonstick one there. You'll be happy, honey. Here's your silverware. And here's the rest of your, um, your um, kitchen utensils along with a uh, measuring cup. Let's see if the fridge opens up the right way. And it does. 
And I'll bet you I gotta turn the ice maker on. And there's noise. I'll have to uh, I'll have to figure out how to turn the ice maker on because there is no ice. Is it up there? Is it up here? Yeah. Uh, doesn't ice say. Maker. Ice maker. Doesn't say power freeze. Reserve. I'll figure it out later. I'll turn this on later. In here, you have a dustpan and a broom along with your trash can and a fire extinguisher. I like this concept though. I do like that. You can put a mop there and whatever you need. Over on this side, again, you've got your sink. you got the dishwasher. Smaller dishwasher. Underneath the sink, dish soap, dishwasher, liquid detergent, dish rag, and also a sponge. Interesting that they use some of the old items from before because that's an older item because of the color. Yeah. That color's gone away. Dish strainer, yeah. yeah. And you have the sink. It's not. It's a. It's a smaller sink, kitchen sink. But it works. Yep. It's functional. Mm -hmm. Then that's going to the bedroom. So you already showed the television, right? Well, not really. But here is the television. Um, <laughs> and same same view out the back window as there is in the um, studio out on the pool for the Flamingo Hilton. So the one thing you'll realize about Las Vegas, the windows don't open. So you know. None of the windows open. I will tell you the reason for that later so the master bedroom nice master bedroom i love that headboard man i love that headboard so where do you want to start the master bedroom but where here let's go oh over here there is a there is a working table this is why i said i didn't want to use that other thing for a computer desk because there was one in here i oh. noticed that when i walked through and turned the lights on and there's your usbs with your electrical outlet Interesting, and there is actually cabinets. That's unusual. Drawers here. One thing I will say, this chair with the way it's set up, it could be, a, it might be a little difficult. Yeah, is that our dressing cabinets? Yeah, I think Because that that's gotta be, if you're here for a long period of time when I'm back, is that where our dressing? cabinet is could very well be. because even though there's no cabinets here but we're not done yet okay so let's look uh two end tables let's see is there a usb on? yeah there is usb on the end tables right there the king size bed and again i love that headboard you've got a seating bench here for like putting shoes on and things like that long full length mirror like we mentioned hi hon on into the bathroom so that did not change no that was there before yes they did not get rid of the whirlpool corner tub but they did remodel the rest of it it's not a whirlpool it's just a soaking tub. oh is it yeah okay uh they do have the uh the mirror above the lighted mirror above the uh, above the uh, bathroom i wish that they would have done double sinks right it's, it's only mm -hmm. single sinks but i wish they would have done double nothing in this one there should be a hair dryer and toilet paper in there and nothing oh. in that one and where's the Let's take a look in here, see what's in here. So this is the vanity. This is still weird. This has got to be where we're supposed Nothing. to put our clothes. Nothing. Along so with that. The Safe. Where is the hair dryer and the... In there. Okay. It's in a different room. So this is... Oh, now I know why. This is the part for the master bedroom because of the one bedroom. If you have people sleeping in the living room, you have to go through here because you share the bath. Oh, I see. So the hair dryer should be officially here. So technically you do have two sinks, honey. Okay, yes, there's another sink out here. Right. And that's where all your towels are. And I'll bet you if you open those drawers, you'll find um, your hair dryer. Not in this one, Let's see if it's in this one here. There it is. Yeah, there you go, extra toilet paper in your to uh, hair dryer. Then you have a nice size toilet area and a shower. And the shower is bigger over here. Is it? I don't know if it's taller, but it's definitely bigger. Okay, go in here. We have to do another shower test. It's not taller, but there is a grab bar uh -huh. uh, and a place for this, um, but, but it's not. But it is wider. So not, the shower not, has not been remodeled. Yeah, not bigger this right. way. It's not bigger this way, but it's a little bigger this way. Yeah. Still a little tight though. And the thing I'm not sure if I like the towel hook is all the way over here. 
So you've got the shower over here, but you have the towel hook all the way over here. So quite a distance. What's this? Like the two oh, doors. That's where we were. Right, the two doors. So this is a pocket door. Mm -hmm. So someone could be in the shower. Hi. So there you go. The Hilton Grand Vacation Flamingo, the uh, one bedroom and the studio. We've got them both. So basically we can sleep one, two, six. three, four, five, six. We can sleep six here. That's what you got, the one bedroom and the studio at the Hilton uh, Grand Vacations at the Flamingo. Hopefully it's informative for you. Thanks for watching. If you've not hit that subscribe button below, love for you to do so right now. And, and the bell notification button, love for you to hit the like button too, because that helps us out immensely. Thanks for watching and have yourself a magical day.